bud. Well, come here and give me one. Come on, don't be shy. Ah, that's great. Another video lesson by JKZ. I'm JKZ. Today's lesson we'll be discussing short game, mainly chipping. The first thing you do when you're around the green is identify what type of shot you want to hit. Here we have a downhill chip, so we don't need anything to go very high. We'll just let the ground kind of do the work for us. Okay, so based on what type of shot we want to hit, that's going to determine our ball position. For a lower shot, I'm going to hit, I'm going to put the ball back in my stance, in the middle of my back foot. Okay, that's going to make sure the ball comes out low. The reason why is because when the ball is played on the back of my foot, I'm de-locked in the club, making the ball come out lower. Okay, it's going to run out a little bit more then. If I was going to hit a high shot, I'd play it a little bit more towards the front of my stance or towards the target. Okay, you can see that that changes the shaft angle. Now we're adding more loft to the club. Okay, so how do we execute the shot? After the ball is placed in the back of our stance, club is de-lofted. Okay, now it's about what body parts do I use. It's not going to be the hands or the wrists. Okay, it's the arms. Okay talking about angle retention here you want the club shaft to be in the same spot back here and in the finish okay you can't execute or do that properly with the hands or the wrists it has to be done with the arms okay so the angle that I I set up at a dress is going to be at the same here and here club face remains square the whole time toe and the heel move together okay let's see how it's done Ball position back, club face square and shut, use the arms. I determined my shot based on the geography. Ball position determines my trajectory. And I use my arms to maintain the angle and not my hands or my wrist. JKZ, AGB, always get better. <laughs> 